Hello and I welcome you all to the fresh episode of Defense Fallout. And today we speak about the IFF. What is the identification of friend or foe system? Now suppose you are sitting at a radar ground station and monitoring the aerial aircraft movements and all of the sudden a bunch of dots appear on your radar screen. Now how do you identify them as your friend or as your enemy? One of the ways is you vector your aircraft in the vicinity or you scramble interceptors and identify them manually. But that doesn't always work and not practical. So what can we do? Why can't we have a system which is inbuilt in your radars and also in your friendly aircrafts so they can exchange signals and identify each other? Do we have any such systems? Yes, we have. And here where the role of IFF comes in. That is the identification of friend and foe systems. Usually an IFF contains two parts. One is the IFF interrogator which is based usually on a ground station and emits an interrogating signal to the aircraft and asks the IFF transponder to respond in a different frequency from the interrogator. If the IFF transponder responds on a different frequency using its inbuilt keys, it's all good and the aircraft is your friend. But wait, what if it responds uh, differently or it doesn't respond at all? Then the aircraft is identified as foe or an enemy aircraft and the aircraft type is identified using the radar signatures for further action. Now you might think this works cool. If you respond, you are the friend or if you don't respond, you are my enemy. Now there is a catch. What if I being an en enemy for a X country and I imitate their uh, identification code or I imitate their uh, transponder. Now this doesn't uh, sounds good. So anyone uh, even an enemy aircraft can be identified as a friend. Now here where the cryptographic computers come in where the signals exchanged between the IFF interrogator and the IFF transponder are encrypted and prevent stealing of identification codes and imitate as a friendly aircraft. Now IFF is not only the way to confirm an aircraft identity but squawk codes which are given by the ATC, aircraft electronic signatures and also their flying behaviors are other factors to identify an aircraft as a friend or as a foe. Now the IFF works effectively to prevent friendly fires and used to prevent enemy aircrafts from airspace violations. Based on the IFF data they can be uh, exchanged with the data link systems where friendly air defense units can engage enemy aircrafts and prevent friendly fires that's it for today thank you jai hind vande mataram